you know, one thing that we hear in the United States very often is why should someone like Edward Snowden or the reporters that he chose to work with decide what is public and what is secret? Um, shouldn't we entrust those decisions to people who, in a democracy, after all, we elected, uh, or to people they appointed? Doesn't it uh, provide more democratic legitimacy to have those officials in a democracy make those decisions? Um, my response to them is, let's imagine the last 10 or 15 years, if the government officials to whom we've entrusted those decisions had their way every time. Um, in the United States, we would not have known that the case for war in Iraq was trumped up based on false evidence. Uh, we would not have known that the United States tortured prisoners in Abu Ghraib, that the CIA set up secret prisons around the world and uh, applied what they called enhanced interrogation techniques on them, uh, that the U.S. used drones for targeted killings far from any active battlefields. Um, all of this information is information that our government tried to prevent the public from ever learning. And the reason why we know about it in the detail that we do is because people within the system provided the information to aggressive and courageous journalists, and those journalists made the decision against government opposition to publish it in their newspapers. Um, can, can we legitimately say that our democracy would be stronger if those journalists had not done that? Um, so I think that journalists play a very, very vital role uh, now, I think that they have played that role extremely responsibly. Uh, I haven't heard of a single case uh, where a journalist reporting on, on the Snowden documents has done so without first consulting with the governments um, that are most relevant and would be most affected. Um, so this is something that they take seriously and that they do carefully. Um, but, but again, uh, without a free press, uh, then we would have presidents and their appointees uh, deciding for themselves what information we should have on which to judge them. Um, and, and that is very corrosive to a democracy. It's why the First Amendment to the U.S. Constitution is the one that protects the free press and the freedom of speech.